One of the exciting new features in PC Building Simulator 2 is the ability to mod your PC case to actually paint it or apply a theme or apply stickers. So we're gonna check out exactly how this feature works right now. So what you need to do is walk up to a workstation and you refit the bench if it's not already in mod mode, so hit B. You've got, of course, a choice of build mode, case modding or water cooler. We're gonna do case modding here. So here's how it works. Basically, grab a case that you like. I'm gonna use the Cooler Master Cosmos C700P. But what we can do is we can grab any of these tools here. So we've got our themes, we've got our spray paint, eraser, stickers. I'm gonna start with themes. We can hit apply and boom, we've got a theme on the front, the top and the back side panel. Now we don't have anything on the glass. We can change this setting here, apply on glass. That's gonna be actually on all of the different modes and hit apply again. And now we have our theme across our glass. So if you didn't want the transparent side panel, there you go. And there's a bunch of themes to choose from. We've got 38 in here so far. Uh, so all sorts of things, we've got cool patterns. We've got cheetah print, we've got camo, there's gummy bears, what else, you know, everything you could ever want. This looks like a bowling ball. Uh, so that's themes. Now stickers, now of course you could you could use this theme as the base and then you could you could paint over it, you could apply stickers over it, or you could just clear it all out. Uh, so if we go back to theme and we hit clear, we're back to a clear case. So you can decide what you wanna do. You can use the themes as a good starting point or you can just start from scratch. So let's say we start from scratch and we wanna let people know that we're using thermal paste on our computer, which I would really recommend that you do. Again, we have the apply on glass on there so we can do it if we turn it off, we aren't able to do that. We'll turn it on and then we can apply stickers anywhere on any of the areas that were basically had a theme on them earlier. Those are gonna be our paintable, stickerable, uh, themable area. So we can put this here. We can change the size by holding control and scrolling. So we can make this really big, really obnoxiously thermal pasted, or we can also change the angle by holding alt. We can turn that around. We can just, you know, just stick that right there. So we'll stick that there. You know, we can throw one of these up here. We're really letting people know. It's also going to be liquid cooled. Now, of course, you can do this on just the case or you can do it on a fully built computer. Um, so that is how the stickers work. Painting works similarly. We're gonna grab our spray paint can here. We've got a soft and a hard tool. The soft tool is gonna give you more of that softer edged airbrush look. The hard is gonna give you those sharp lines. We've got a transparency slider to actually set the opacity of the paint and then a nozzle size to adjust the size of the tool. We'll turn on the applying glass here and then we can go ahead and paint. Now, at this point, we'll be painting over our stickers. So the most recent thing that you do is always gonna go over top of things you did earlier. So if we painted first, then we could put stickers over it later. So you just need to think ahead and think about your order if you wanna start layering different elements over each other. If we had had the theme down, we'd be doing all of this over the theme. So it makes sense. Um, we can go ahead and we could, if we just wanted to maybe set this whole side to be solid cyan, we could do that very easily and just sort of fill that in. It gets a little tricky on the edges when the tool is large. So there you go. That is kind of an overview of how it works. Painting, stickers, and themes opens up a ton of different possibilities. The option to you to paint on glass or to not. Uh, you can really take any computer and make it your own, your own unique, one-of-a-kind creation in PC Building Simulator 2.